Before I move on to the, today's report, just due to risk and a possible way for noted by Dr. Peter Juni, not by the government. Please do not have any gatherings, especially during Victoria Day. Who knows my, who might get affected next? Okay, Ontario. Today's case. It is a uh, coronavirus. Uh, They four hundred thirty one. Stay at home uh, two day forty. And we have a surprisingly low uh, one one thousand sixteen sixteen cases today. Okay, cool. Yeah, it is uh, the lowest uh, case that uh, they since uh. It's up uh, March and uh, the lowest uh, since uh, 2021 that started. Uh, four on, so uh, 472 cases are from Toronto, 360 from Peel Region, 116 from uh, York Region, 114 from Hamilton, uh, 102 from Durham Region, all under. Uh, 500 cases. That's all of the regions reported under 100 cases. 17 deaths uh, reported today. Uh, and variants. The UK variants are at 110,956. An increase of a uh, two thousand one hundred and fifty five six eighty one uh, South African variants uh, plus two two thousand and thirty one uh, Brazilian variants uh, plus ten and uh, India double mutant variant is still at a uh, forty five unknown where uh, it's. Uh, where the cases have been from. Uh, the previous ones are from Brampton, 36, 141 case from uh, Ottawa, and additionally two deaths. And where did the 45 uh, come from? We don't know. The, the government never bothered to really tell us. And of course, they, they haven't done much. I'll continue to like break, like uh, insult the government until they finally do or something. So India is going through a hard wave of wave two of uh, coronavirus, uh, and also because of coronavirus cases and India double mutant fire variant cases. Uh, So ventilators have been sent from to India and arrived by 500 of them right now. By instructions of uh, Doug Ford and five, 500 that landed, India uh, sent a happy uh, thank thank you Ontario for sending it. We are and they're that they're grateful. On, and unfortunately, there's no mass screen screening to detect the India double mutant variant, unlike for the for the other three variants, which is absolutely just idiotic. If you finally like labeled, you finally labeled it as a variant of concern, maybe they should do it.
vaccine bookings are down detailed up. Okay. Today is the day. People 18 and up can uh, book their vaccines, uh, which was originally for next week, but now they can do it this week. They can do it six days earlier. And also through a local uh, the, the local health unit uh, that works up. So you can uh, begin the people can uh, book it uh, through uh, on the official website uh, COVID nineteen Ontario CA slash book vaccine by phone one eight 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 nine 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 six four eight eight at a local pharmacy. You won't have to wait. So, Pfizer vaccines are at select pharmacies for those uh, 18 plus uh, at Toronto and Peel region and all pharmacies in the Durham, Durham region, Hamilton, Ottawa, Windsor, Essex region, and York region uh, providing Moderna vaccines. And vaccine. Uh, Bookings are eligible for children 12 to 17 years old starting May 31st with the Pfizer BioNTech vaccine uh, and also uh, through stead, special uh, dedicated youth and family clinics uh, throughout uh, the week of uh, June 14th and June 21st only because uh, the apparently the Pfizer BioNTech vaccine is the only vaccine out there that is approved for use for those under 18. Hopefully uh, other vaccines will join that that list too. Stay at, stay at home rules are down, down below too. So already, already, uh, some some uh, area, areas of uh, regions are uh, using the hotspots technically, uh, using up uh, specific postal codes, uh, which is con really confusing for uh, people. Uh, so those are uh, eighteen and up have been allowed to vac vaccinate, and. Uh, the Peel region played played it smart and vaccinated everyone in the region that is 18 and older or so. So Doug Ford reported uh, seven million va seven million vaccinations already. So and um, and uh, that number will soon increase. So remember, enforcement uh, officials have the authority to break up uh, gatherings uh, of any kind, uh, aka all gatherings, uh, if it ain't from the uh, same uh, household. Uh. So fines for breaking that emergency uh, and. And then the uh, Civil uh, Provi Protection Act, uh, or yeah, whatever, whatever. The EMCPA rule uh, for lockdown and stay at home uh, order. Uh, so $750 uh, per person. Uh, and sometimes uh, $180, $130 might be added, depends. Uh, 
Proto police did this uh, to uh, the people uh, fishing in uh, by the Karen Canarasco River from people outside the city, the town. And you can probably guess where they were from, Toronto, and uh, Vaughn Woodbridge, and the Scarborough part of Toronto. What well, eight hundred eighty dollars through ride check if they are caught doing this? Timmins proved Timmins uh, police police uh, had to stop. Uh, Five people uh, in a car from uh, Brant Brantford from five different different addresses in Brantford. Yeah, they weren't too happy about that. And ride checks are not like random stops. They are like a, a certain checkpoint that you have to go. That you, if you're going through a certain road and there's a checkpoint right there, yeah. It's not like a random stop right here or there or there. And it's 100% legal. Uh, $1,000 for uh, preventing others from following orders. One million for if it's severe or and possibly jail time. Hospitalization is uh, one fourteen eight eighty four. Uh, people are hospitalized with uh, cor the coronavirus. Uh, uh, plus uh, one hundred sixty four. Uh, Seven hundred sixty four. Uh, I I see you, patient. Uh, minus fifteen. As uh, some uh, less stress uh, for the critical care nurses. Uh, 559 uh, ICU patients using a ventilator, plus 23. Although hospitalization that sort of went down uh, compared to uh, when it was like really ridiculously uh, serious. Uh, So long-term care homes that uh, cases that uh, have uh, increased uh, to uh, three thousand seven hundred sixty-six now, plus one thirteen uh, staff uh, that uh, unchanged and three thirty-five uh, outbreaks, uh, which is an increase of. Uh, of uh, one uh, since uh, yesterday. Well, please uh, follow coronavirus safety rules, rules and regulations uh, and stay at home rules. Uh, I think we have like at least uh, 15 to 16 days uh, of a uh, stay at home uh, and then we're home free if, uh, if we're... Please do not have any gatherings, uh, especially on Victoria days uh, for the safety of others. Uh, we're on a good streak going down. Not trying to bring the number of cases numbers more, more down. Stay safe. And don't forget to book your vaccinations if you're eligible. I'm getting vaccinated uh, next week.